Hello people, this is HMS Duck and this is Call of Duty Black Ops. I'm just going to show you the the Blackbird chopper gunner gunship which is 8, 9, 11. You don't see much of the Blackbird, it's just, this is my little helper here. That's my son and this is his Xbox because I don't break the law. Actually I do because <laughs> I'd get done for it but anyway, it's another story. So, let me just turn these comms up a little bit. I don't know. There we go. Um, he's just going to die for me so we can have a little look at what to expect when the game gets properly released. I don't know where I'm going there. Let's, uh, I tell you now, as soon as you get the game, turn your sensitivity up. Not like Modern Warfare up. I mean, up, up. <laughs> you need to be like, if you're a, I think if you're a 3 or a 4, on Modern Warfare 2 you need to be a 6 or 7 on this that, that's how it felt to me anyway and these first few bits I didn't I just can't see it there I wasn't even hitting him in the head but like you've got to I've only just come on here just to show that and don't judge my gun <laughs> my gun skills but there's a little bit of a kick to the Enfield this is where the this is where I turn my sensitivities up the SAAT is, or the IWAT if you're so compliant, was, is where the, the Enfield was where the SAAT derived from. And this is a chopper gunner, and you're going to see that if, <laughs> he looks more powerful than Modern Warfare 2 to me, it looks ridiculously overpowered, but it might just be first impressions, tell me what you think, but watch the spawning. Whether that's because we haven't took the flags and I'm just demonstrating, but he does at some point. No, he doesn't. He just spawns there and the time after time again. Seems a bit strange. I don't know whether. This map's crap, by the way. It's going to be one of those <coughs> small maps that some people love. I don't particularly like them. I like medium, long range gunfights, not shotgun fights, but I've used this map so I ain't going to run across to find him every time I want to kill him as you can see it's just an absolute bloodbath and it gets worse when the gunship <laughs> the gunship comes up but to be fair there isn't there doesn't seem a lot there's not a lot of difference between the two apart from you get your, your rockets on your gunship it's probably that the gunship is harder to take down than the chopper gunner that's me turning my is that me turning my sensitivity up? Oh my gun swapping my yeah. So here comes the gunship. And there's the rockets. And here's the primary weapon. But the fun part about this is you're actually flying the helicopter. Your left thumbstick is forward and back, your right thumbstick left and right. Right trigger is the primary weapon, left trigger is your rockets. Now, as you can see again, just spawning opposite sides of the road. Now, for some reason the spawn's slightly changed. He's spawning opposite opposite the road. This, I'm hoping this is because we haven't took any flags and it's just a, confused. <laughs> but I would have thought it should be with all these buildings that they should have put it in that you should spawn inside after getting killed like this. But there's going to be some. If you think that buying this game, you're going to all Modern Warfare problems are going to be gone and that this game is going to be the solution and it, I don't think so, I think that you're going to have as many problems on this by the look of it from what I've seen, I hope I'm wrong I really do but there is some <laughs> weird shit happening there's going to be a lot of overpowered weapons in the game a lot of overpowered kill streaks but we'll have to see that's this one coming to an end. Right then people, this is the second part of the map. Uh, second part of the video even. I mean, this is The map is jungle. This is one map I wanted to show you really quickly. It's, um, it's my first favourite map of the game. This is not my first favourite gun of the game. The G11 is awful. It's The scopes on it are terrible. It looks terrible. <laughs> I can't see anybody using this very much. The scope, it's not a bad scope, but 
and the fire doesn't jump there's no re doesn't seem a lot of recoil to the gun but look at the bounce on it and it's even worse with the variable zoom so I can't see this being very popular at all but this is that first route there was where the baby buffalo are going to run and graze this is up there is where you're going to get some snipers and this is B I'm going to show you, show you quickly this map because like I said I haven't recorded this very well but I've just kind of like thrown it all together so I can just get some bit of footage to you and show you a couple of the things that I think people will want to see a decent map like this now this is this is C you've got this I'm going to spin around here <laughs> there's a little jump up here you'll spawn at C jump up here up the ladder this is where the snipers are going to be and anybody wanting to fancy some long range kills you can catch people running across the bridge heading towards B I do random shooting in this as well <laughs> thought I could try and sink it afterwards but it ain't going to work uh, down there is where the baby buffalo zone and you get people coming down there this is going to get, catch people having a look over that, this balcony people running across this bridge here so this is a good advantage uh, vantage point where people are going to crack gun it's disgusting Whee. there's my kneecaps gone Alright, this is the C spawn again. This is the back route, which is going to be the more long drawn out way of getting around the back of everybody. This will probably be a kind of route that I'll be taking. I'm go around the back here. There's a couple of ways I can come down through. Uh, well, I ain't going to come through the middle past B there, but that's B down there. Bang, bang, bang. Then you're going to get around the back here. You're going to catch people on the way, I would imagine, doing the same sort of thing. Take them out back here up to I probably dodge the flag and try and take them people out going across the bridge there there's not a lot more to tell you about this map but I'll try anyway well where else do I go here so look this is all off the cuff there's a there's a little house up here look, that I was looking for you jump across this plank here up into or you can just walk through like any normal person would do right it, look down to B here, it's a little high advantage points down to the left is where the route that I took around the back which is one of the routes I'd be taking somebody up here is somebody I don't want to be seen <laughs> they've got advantage over me they're gonna shooting down on me I've got no chance so it's somebody I'm gonna want to be bumping into you route down to be there across the middle here where the baby buffalo graze or run this is where the other route from C where you're going to be looking across to me C is definitely the best the best spawn here without a the shadow of a doubt there's so many much positives to it even looking across from here they might have the high advantage up there but you've just so much more cover down here and he's up to their spawn up there but see they they're in a lot of cover over this side them rocks are going to provide better cover over here is my personal favourite of the map, part of the map, Mr Skull and Crossbones there and this is what you'll be doing <laughs> first time you go on it, well you probably won't know because I've just warned you but <laughs> here's the crossbow, if you fire into a wall and you're a dumbass this is what will happen, <laughs> right that's about it anyway so it's been Agent Miss Dog thrown together, I hope you've enjoyed it and there'll be more to come, just let us know what you want to see and I'll be back with it. Keep it real, people.